Hi, this is Marty Carter with Sumner One Service. Today I'm with a Konica Minolta BizHub 558, and we're gonna talk about print errors. When you get a print error, first thing I wanna find out is what's causing the problem. Is it a setting at the copier itself, or is it a setting within the document that you printed from your computer? At the copier, I'm gonna to touch the copy mode. Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look at the paper sources and I'm gonna to touch where it says paper. Here, I can tell right away that the problem is most likely caused by settings with the machine. So in this instance, I see lots of problems with sizes and types. For instance, this machine has three paper drawers. I can see in tray one, it displays A3, that's a European size. Tray two has question marks. Tray three says eight and a half by 11 letter size. And the hand feed bypass shows correctly eight and a half by 11 paper. So let's take a look at these paper trays. Tray one, A3, is that true? I'm gonna open this drawer and see that the paper guide is not flush to each edge. Sometimes people can aggressively slam these trays shut causing the guide to expand on its own. Now the guide is flush to each edge and we will see in the screen the change reflect. And now it correctly says 11 by 17 paper. Now let's take a look at tray two. Why does that have question marks? I'm gonna open tray two. Again, guides are not flush to each edge of the paper. Both guides. Now, when I close the tray, you'll see that change correctly now, eight and a half by 11 letter paper. Now, I notice another problem. Notice tray three. You'll see some symbols on the side of that rectangle. One of them, the one in the upper area, is just telling you that it's halfway full of paper. That's fine. But the lower one, this piece of paper, defines the type of paper that's loaded into that tray. With any of the trays, you can change the type of paper that's in the tray by selecting the tray and touching Change Tray Settings. Here, we can see that tray three is set to thick paper. Thus, everything we print from our computer that's on plain paper will find a conflict there's thick paper, it can't print, it throws print errors. I need to change this to plain paper. When I do that, you'll notice in this screen now, there is no longer a symbol in the lower right hand corner, nor is there a symbol in the lower right hand corner of any of the other sources. So now this machine is true to size in each tray and it's true to type plain paper in every source. Try your print job now. My bet is it's gonna work. You won't get print errors anymore. If you do, it's most likely something caused by a setting at the computer end. Thank you.